we are the Gator Boys. I got a fax from the Florida Wildlife Commission for a gator inside of a garage. Somebody sees a gator in their garage, they close the doors, and then call you. That's what these guys did. Hey, is this Southern Diesel? Yeah. Uh, hey, how's it going, Paul? How's it going? So, uh, you got gator problems? Been back there by the pond the past couple weeks. Yeah. You know, been trying to stay away from me. Finally came in the building. Back there, you know, sitting underneath the trailer back there last time we seen him. We locked him in. He came right in. Just straight mouth. through here? Just straight to the back. Oh, right there. there. Having an alligator here to kind of slow everything down. Couldn't get anything done. Nobody wanted to work. Nobody wanted to stay in the shop. And right now, I just want to get this gator out of my shop and get things back rolling again. OK, watch out, man. Check this thing out. Oh, he's right there next to the door. All right. Let's get him out of here. He's, he's seven and a half, man. For me, a gator this size, you're talking six, seven feet, thin, wiry, lightning fast. That's the most dangerous. He might be jumping. You know, I'm spinning into uh, an axle of a car or into the concrete wall. You kind of want to work them. You move real well. You have sneakers on, you've got good traction. His feet are, aren't really made for concrete. If myself or Scott slip on oil and, you know, our head smashes down near the alligator, you know, you get your head cracked open with concrete, and then somebody else comes over and bites you in the head. It's not a good thing. Watch out, man. All right, Scott, I'm going to frontal him. Let's see if I can pull him out here. Ready? Yep. Walk up on him. Go. Okay, grab his jaws, get his head back. He's a beautiful little gator. A gator in a building like this is, uh, it's easier because he's got nowhere to go, but he also feels more afraid. You know, obviously, having an alligator out there, no one's going to get any work done because people are freaked out. It's just a distraction, too. So uh, at least we're able to get them out of here, and now these guys can get back to work. Hey, put in pants. Come back. Foot, foot, foot. 